We are proud to claim Jack White here in Middle Tennessee, but his food is known all over the world. Glad to have you back with <laughs> Thank us. Thank you, today. Leland. Good to see you. All right. Not only is it just known all over the world, it's known in movie scenes. You just got back from New York for the Hunger Games. Just got back from New York. Games. Talk uh, about that. Well, I got invited to New York. The Hunger Games has a 10,000 square foot exhibit at um, the museum on Times Square, the Discovery Museum, mm -hmm. and it's a interactive like display where you walk through and you see everything and there's a really great section on the food that you see in the Hunger Games and how we created it and how we made it and and, and again really the great. deal on that is the reason you are there is yeah. because those food scenes you are the one who creates <laughs> that, right? Uh -uh. Well, it's me and a lot of other people. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but we did all the cooking. We did all the cooking here in Tennessee, and then we, well, for the first one, we cooked the suckling pig. You know, she shoots the arrow out of its mouth. Yeah. We cooked that in Pulaski. We cooked most almost everything in Pulaski, and we trucked it to North Carolina. And then for the Atlanta, for the second one, we they built me a kitchen down there, and we just moved everything <laughs> down there and cooked it all. So, uh, so fantastic. So now, while that's, uh, when that's, uh, I guess, going on, you're doing that. That, but also, folks can get food from you if they just drive down to Pulaski. Uh, you've got Savory's Jack, right? Savory Jack's restaurant. Yeah, we're just right off the square in Pulaski, so uh -huh. it's 227 North First Street. All right, so, so got a great recipe. For we have a today. really Talk great about recipe this. today. Great for the summer. We, uh, well, you know, summer's here, and all the farmers, local farmers, are growing a lot of good stuff. So we thought we'd do something fun with just some good fresh vegetables. All right, we're today making a zucchini a and squash casserole okay. with some onions. But this recipe is really great, Leland, because you can add bacon, you can add chicken, you can add whatever vegetables, peppers, mm -hmm. whatever you like. But we start with two cups of sour cream, mm -hmm. and this is just a small can of condensed um, cream of mushroom soup. You can use cream of chicken, you can use whatever. And then we have a cup of really nice Parmesan cheese. Okay. And so that becomes our sauce. So we're gonna just mix all of that together. I've sliced the, the um, zucchini and the squash. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I got a cup of water too. I was wondering why that was so thick there. So, and just to loosen it up a little bit. All right. And, and before you put the veggies in there, are you using farmers down there? Where are you getting your uh, farmers market on the? They're just right off the square in Pulaski. Okay. Where I got these. So yeah, we try to. We're, you know. Summer months are great because Tennessee's got some really great exactly. produce growing. You know, during the winter, it's, <laughs> it's a little bit hard. But that's what I'm saying now. Everybody should go out and shop at a local farm market and see what they can find. Okay. So you're just gonna dump this into the bowl. This is so easy. And then we're going to just toss it up, get it nice and covered. And then right into that dish. I'm not going to be able to get it all out of this bowl <laughs> here. One of the great things too, you're using this is because this is what's fresh right now. It's but fresh right now. They can swap the veggies. Oh, absolutely, out of this. absolutely, yes. They can add whatever kind of whatever your favorite, you know, eggplant, whatever. It, it's just a really simple, you know. <clears throat> I was laughing that some of the older recipes I saw for something like this had cooking the zucchini for like 30 minutes in boiling water. I was like, oh no, we don't want to do that. We like to keep <laughs> it fresh. So just a little toss, okay. and then we go right into the. Pyrex dish here and just right. kind of push it around, get it all spread out there. And as you get ready for the panko crumbs here, what's yeah. big on the menu right now if they came down to see you? If they came down tonight, we have Pulaski hot chicken. We know, Na we know chicken. Nashville's famous for it, but Pulaski's stepping it up. So uh -huh. we have Pulaski hot chicken. We also have a really great mild green uh, chili sauce to go with that. And our special this week, we have a bone in pork shank that we are slow cooking for like six hours. You just touch the meat with the fork and it Ooh. just falls right off. <laughs> so that's our this week special. All right, but so that's what everything looks like when it is said and yeah. done. This is Savory Jack Squash Casserole, recipe number 5393 online right now. Go check out Savory Jack's restaurant down in Pulaski. That's down in Giles County. A beautiful drive this yes, time it is. of the year. Thank you very Thank much you for being with us uh -huh. again today.